what, what the haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? I now bring to you one of the all-time greats. An April Fool's prank so good, it needs to be on television. Let me set it up for you. I hit up my homeboy, Bruce, with a text message this morning. Told him I had some money for him. <laughs> he hit me back, April Fool's. So he didn't bite. I felt like a failure. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to make this thing work. So I hit up one of my other homeboys, Jimmy, to help me sell it. Jimmy is a guy who Bruce don't know. But I told him that Jimmy has a media company and he needs somebody to work his social media. And he's willing to pay top dollar. So I called Jimmy and Bruce got him on the three-way. We talked about the money. We got the business part out of the way first. So Jimmy's going to pay Bruce $5,000 per account. And he got 10 accounts he want to start him off with. And he's going to pay him three months in advance. So that's 150 racks. And I get Jimmy to, to agree to fly in to Houston to talk about it tonight on his private jet. Now Jimmy is loaded, right? So we decide to make it more personal when I, after I hang up the phone with Bruce, me and Jimmy, we conspire to take it to the next level. So he decides that, you know, I want to hook up with some girls. And then he decided to take it even further than that by saying, look, man, uh, can you bring a dog? <laughs> so that's what we are. And y'all going to hear a lot of laughing in the back. When you hear me laughing while they're talking, I, I have the phone on mute. All right? So check it out. Enjoy. No more talk. This is one of the best. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, man. <laughs> that nigga blew. People, people go, you know. You know what? Hey. <laughs> you know what? Hey, you know what? <laughs> Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. That that and hey, that'll 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 be the April Fool's. You know, you just keep on going and going and going, and then let him figure the April Fool part out. <laughs> yeah. Let's do it like that. Alright, All right. Uh hold on. Hello. Bruce. Uh-huh. Boy, this motherfucking Jimmy off the chain, man. This nigga here. Yeah. Hey. You know, this motherfucking nigga called me back talking about fucking with some dogs. This nigga, this nigga is wild, dog. I'm like, dude. Uh, you know, we on we. This is the south, but we ain't that deep down in the south. You talking about putting a dog on these women? You know what I'm saying? That shit there. Yeah, nigga, like that nigga is that nigga wild, dog. But it's like the thing is, like I'm like, man, fuck it, get the money, dog. Get the money. You know, like shit, fuck what, fuck whatever the nigga like. You know what I'm saying? Fuck it, nigga. You wanna, you want some opiates, nigga, nigga, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm, I'm thinking like, man, let's get, let's get the money, you know. Yeah. But uh, uh, shit. But what you think about that shit? What you want me to tell this nigga about this motherfucking dog shit? No, can't do that. I'm telling him to get some pussy and yeah, they got whips and chains, but don't you know you can't be abusing nobody. All right, well, shit. Well, we well. Don't want that. Well, ho hold on, cause I'm gonna let you tell her. Hello? Yeah. 
Hey, 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 Jimmy. Jimmy. Hey, 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 man. I'm, I'm shit. I'm trying to get you what you need, homie. But uh, the, uh you know that 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 other thing. You know what I'm saying? That little four legged thing. Huh? Shit. I don't know. Uh, Bruce on the phone. Bruce, tell him what's up. Say, say, uh, say, Jimmy, um, what is the significance of, of the dog being black? It's a class of colors. I mean, I, I just think you have the, the white <laughs> skin along with the black dog. It just goes to the overall dynamics of everything. <laughs> Hey, uh, Bruce, can you, um, uh, <clears throat> say, so, uh, hey, he already got a, um, he already got a room at, the, uh, Four Seasons, so, I mean, well, a suite, he got a suite at the Four Seasons, so, that's where we gonna meet up at. Alright. Uh, yeah, so, uh, uh, so, let me see. Uh, hey, Bruce, is it, it, is it anything that you need? Yeah, because uh, the Four Seasons is uh, uh, pet friendly. So they, they, no, it is. Uh, yeah, they pet friendly. So they, yeah, I know that for a fact. Yeah. Okay. Let me make something happen. Yeah. Okay. Hey, may, hey uh, but hey, make sure that dog is trained, though, dog. You know, potty trained or whatever. Hey, hey, anything else, Jimmy? Well, you know, now that I think about it, I mean, I, I'm just saying, like, <clears throat> if we could throw a cat in there. Twin in there, I think that would be good. <laughs> 
<laughs> why not, Bruce? He said, why not? I don't know any time you're twins. <laughs> <laughs> The black dog, the black, the black dog, uh, the black dog contrasting with the white skin. <laughs> We call Bruce, man, because Bruce can make it happen. <laughs> what you need? I'm, I'm, hey, you know, I'm gonna figure out like, oh, yeah, I'm gonna like that. I'm 